In this video I show you why you should never throw away lemon peel again, but what you can still make from it instead. So be sure to watch the video to the end. Because if you use lemons, for example, to get the juice out here, or use them in some other way, you will of course still have the peel left at the end. But what exactly do you do with the zest of the lemon now? I'm sure most of you will just throw it in the trash can, but it's actually way too good for that. Because we can actually still use it in other ways. Once you've got the juice or pulp out, you'll need to cut the lemon into slightly smaller pieces for this. Something like you see me doing here right now. After that, you'll then need a screw top jar where you're going to throw the lemon peels in now. Depending on how many lemon slices you have left, the jar can be just a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller. Then we need one more ingredient and that's vinegar. We're going to fill our jar up about halfway with vinegar now. Once you've done that, you're going to need a little bit of dishwashing liquid. We're going to add that to the jar as well. But a few small drops are really enough here, it doesn't really have to be a lot. And the rest of the glass we fill up with water until all the lemon peels have disappeared under the liquid. Now you should screw the jar down and set it aside for a few days. And when the time is up, we have to sieve out the liquid because we don't want to have any more pieces in our bottle. And so we then put the liquid into a spray bottle. Because what we have created here now is our own little homemade lemon cleanser that really works wonderfully. And how exactly I would like to show you now. Because with it you can spray just about everything, whether the faucet, your sink or even the work surface. Generally everything you can simply spray with this, then let it act briefly and then clean the dirty spots with a cloth. Due to its composition, this cleaner is really super effective and that thanks to means that we would have otherwise simply thrown away. Also, do you want to know why you should spread shaving cream on a broom? Then be sure to check out the video I'm linking to you here. If you liked the video then I would be really happy about a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and activate the bell so you don't miss any new video.